Further, Mahamate, Maya is not an unreality because it has the appearance of reality, and all things have the nature of Maya. Said Mahamate, Is it, blessed one, that all things are like Maya because Maya is something imagined and clung to as having multitudinousness of individual forms? Or is it due to the incorrect imagining of individual forms? If all things have the likeness of Maya, because Maya is something imagined and clung to as having multitudinousness of individual forms, then see, blessed one, things are not like Maya. Why? Because forms are seen in the multitudinousness of individual signs, not without due causes. If they ever appear without due causes, assuming the multitudinousness of individual signs and shapes, then they would be like Maya. For this reason, blessed one, that things are like Maya is not because they, that is, all things in Maya, are both alike in being imagined and clung to as having multitudinousness of individual signs. Said the blessed one, It is not, Mahamati, that all things are like Maya because they are both alike in being imagined and clung to as having multitudinousness of individual signs, but that all all things are like Maya because they are unreal and like a lightning flash which is seen as quickly disappearing. Mahamate, a lightning appears and disappears in quick succession and is manifest to the ignorant. In the same way, Mahamate, all things assume individuality and generality according to the discrimination of the mind itself. When the state of imagelessness is recognized, objects which are imagined and clung to as in possession of individual signs cease to assert themselves. Thus it is said, Maya is not without reality because it has something resembling it. The reality of all things is talked of in a similar manner. They are unreal like a lightning flash, appearing and disappearing quickly, and therefore they are regarded as resembling Maya.